Welcome back everybody to Diamond Sword RPG. Um, today we are going to pick up right where we left off in the um, forest dungeon. Yes, we are in the uh, we are in the forest dungeon. So this map admittedly got me stuck many, many times. I got stuck in this map many, many times or this part of the map a whole bunch. So let's see if I can't all right, we're already off to a great start. That lever does absolutely nothing. Button. 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 Ha! Nailed it. All right, potion required. All right, who knows? Okay, so... else okay so this is the dark room this is why we had to pick up the potion so then i just get night vision for a couple of minutes and at the end of this is something <laughs> uh, let's see oh gosh i hope i forget if that's a reoccurring theme those little Demon spawning. All right, back, back. Wait, what? Ah, little tiny demon spawn. All right, through here. This opens a door up near the back wall. Not quite ready to go through there yet. Um, I don't remember if I'm able to progress through here. Okay, so let's just climb up here first. I think only if you're really stuck. What's this? Oh, right. Um, there is something else. Nailed it. Okay, sweet. So we got the bow. All right. The voice with eyes is a treasure for a surprise. Okay. So when I when I uh, messed up on my playthrough of this originally, I uh, forgot to I didn't go this way first. Oh yeah, this room. Uh, for those of you who haven't uh, who are playing this and have watched the trailer, this is where I shot one of the scenes. It was me murdering. Well, not necessarily murdering this thing, but shooting this thing. Alright. Eh. So far, so good. Eh. Nice to go. Our first piece of new armor, uh, that helmet, uh, when you, okay, so we're going to be back here at some point later with a lever. I think I have the lever. No, I don't think we got the lever. So we will be back, we will be back through here. At least I, I really hope we will, and I'm not, I'm not going to look like an idiot. So then I believe I've accomplished eh. All right. Cool. I think I've concluded all my business through for now in this area.
Okay, so this is the back door. So here's where I got all screwed up on this. Um, it's dark ahead, but it's possible to light the way. Yep, it is. Alright, leggings. Finally, I have pants. When you... Okay. You gotta be careful here. Nice. Okay, so there's a couple things. First off, down here, uh, not necessarily a requirement, just extra money. Uh, I will go down here in a second. But I want to go in here next. We will need that phone later. So you'll see here that there's, that we're locked behind, or that these chests are presently behind bars. Up there, there's a button. You shoot the button. Just dungeon chest one is locked. Okay, so we do need a key still. Alright, so I believe there's another piece of armor in there. All right, next stop is here. Oof. Come on! Come on, get me out! Ugh, come on. I want out, oh, thank you. So this is a pain in the butt right here. I'm going to show you why. Hardcore parkour. I will go down there eventually as well. Ah, F. You didn't see anything. So that opens that up, which gets me the key for that chest. I've been watching you, and you are progressing well. Thank you. I try. Oh, gosh darn it. Okay. So now, here we go. And down. Oh, thank goodness that's over with. Now, Oh, actually, it was a sword. Nice. Alright. So that's a new sword, which I love. And then the missing lever. Um, not actually going to need that key anymore. There's really no point in keeping it around. Get rid of all that stuff. Get rid of that bottle. Get rid of the armor. Okay. Keep trucking. So 
So there's one last place we gotta go to over here. Or a couple places, I should say. Lots and lots of arrows. Always welcome. Look for a chest that holds a lever. Already did, I got that. Okay, so follow the ground for a secret. Okay, so this is a giant maze. Now the trick with this, with this maze, is you follow the wood. So this wood on the ground, you just follow where it tells you to go. And I think I already failed at doing that. Hang on. Alright, so we go here, look around, wood over here. There we go. You're basically just following the wood. Alright, that's the correct way. This way. I hate silverfish. Keep going, there's wood over here. Wood over here. Keep following the wood on the ground. We're actually at the end here. Alright, so now that's leggings and all right now if, actually if we go underneath here there's a little hidden secret money they say money can't buy happiness well those people obviously have not bought cooked chicken let me tell you So now we got that second. We gotta follow the wood. So now that we have the second lever, we can finally progress through the scary face. Wood, wood log, wood log, door out of here. Ah, yeah, poison spiders. Come on, bite me! Yeah, let's let's try not to die here. We don't actually need to go down below, because that's just if you fail the little jump puzzle. Alright, so now to get back through that door. Actually, I, before I forget about this, if I open up... No combination, just one lever. Now where's that lever? There it is. And the chess piece. So now I have the complete set. I'll dump off my old armor. Uh, we will be able to sell it soon. There is a... Uh, the Ice Palace? I believe is the name of it. Uh, we'll be able to go through there. There's a merchant village and we'll be able to buy, buy our stuff there. Is this a waste of arrows? Probably. Do I care? Not particularly. Okay. Nothing. No, 
nothing, 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 nothing. Gosh darn it. Um, it's never that easy, is it? There's a button. There's gotta be a button somewhere. Ah, right. Lever. Uh, you should wait because the stairs are always late. That they are. Nailed it. Okay. All right. Um, boss fight time. Boss fight. Here we go, guys. Here we go. Boss fight. Uh, you'll never have your sword back. Never. T he he. Oh, shit. I forgot about that part of the boss fight. Okay, you're pretty good at beating my pals. I still have, but I still have your sword. Correct. Okay, I am fair. If you beat me, you can have your sword back. Eh, come on. Oop. There we go. There's the knockback on that. It's crap right there. Okay, you won fair and square. Here's your sword. Back seems you're a good sword fighter. You can pass, but until we meet again. Yay! Um, forest dungeon level two completed. Um, press to summon cart onto the track. Okay, so this is a minecart thing. Mick usually throws one in every single one of his maps. Look ahead while traveling in the mine. Traveling in the minecart. No screaming. Can do. Um, the minecart is 100% safe. Don't get out. Sit back. Enjoy the ride. Here we go. Damn. Leap of faith here. Oops. Excellent, we made it through. All right, so don't leave quite yet. We've still got a little bit of unfinished business to attend to, namely these chests up here. So there's a teleport button and there's the, our Diamond Shard. But now we can leave. So last thing before I actually wrap this episode up, is I'm going to take you guys to this teleport room. Um, as you can probably see, we've got a couple of buttons for that area. 
and I I don't want them really cluttering my inventory. Uh, cluttering up my inventory, I should say. Uh, we will more or less get them out. I'm just happy to have the web cutter back. This is an ex absolutely phenomenal sword. 10 out of 10. Good sword. So our next thing... Oh, no, not our next thing. I lost my train of thought there. Cows. I wonder if there's anything back here. No, it doesn't look like it. You never know where you're actually going to find chests, so never be afraid to, you know, explore around a little bit. Um, that's the one thing I've learned about this. If I were to do a walkthrough of the location of all the chests, I don't think I could. Because every time I've walked through here, I I keep finding new chests. Okay, so the teleport room. Teleport room below, very nice. So during the course of the game, you'll unlock buttons. And these buttons will, will allow you to transport back and forth to dungeons. So for example, the... This one is for the forest dungeon. So we could teleport back to there. Uh, the clockwork tower, or the clock tower, I should say. Tower entrance. Cemetery, Ice Winds, Swamp. Hmm. Oh, this is to enter the Clock Tower. Using Green Time to enter Clock Tower Teleport House. Oh, you know, we might as well head there. So let's head over to Green Town. Break my kneecaps for no reason other than I can. Green Town. Have we been to Green Town yet? Yes, we must have. We must have been to Green Town. So this is for. Uh, press to teleport to the clock tower. Neat. And on top of the clock tower is just a ton of potions and chicken. Money, that sort of thing. So probably one of the most valuable things up here is this chest. Because it has a fake sword. I will take this armor set. I'm not going to use it. But I will take the armor set nonetheless. And then we teleport back to Greentown. Awesome. Awesome. So, uh, in our next episode, we will actually navigate over to the... Oh, well, that's for... Where the hell's the way out of here? Let's finish my thought. There we go. So, in the next episode, we will actually navigate over to the... What is this one? The Swamp Dungeon? Yeah, we'll navigate over to the Swamp Dungeon, and we'll clear that out as well. No, we'll navigate to the Swamp Dungeon because there's a couple side trips I want to make while we're on this journey. And then the episode after that, we'll clear the Swamp Dungeon. So thank you all for your support. Uh, thank you for your continued patronage on the channel. Um, and I will see you all again next time.